Hey, good day there. It's Steve from Steve M Outdoors, the world's most famous redneck preppy. And today, just a quick and dirty video on hook management. I know, very exciting, but bear with me. You might actually find this interesting and or useful. So if you're like me, you're pretty anal about how you store your tackle. Um, I've got a pretty good system going, except the one thing that's always kind of giving me a little bit of grief is hooks and the storage of hooks. Now most people they probably leave them in the package which I don't particularly care for because you're probably putting them in the side pouch of your tackle bag or jamming them into a plain oak tray doesn't work out so good. Leaving them loose though is not so good either because they tend to you know get underneath the dividers in your trays and they're all over the place or worse they turn into this big jumbled mess and god help you when it's cold or it's dark or you got arthritic fingers or all of the above in trying to get one hook out so what's the solution well this is what i use and maybe you'll find this useful safety pins specifically two size of safety pins a two inch safety pin and an inch and a half safety pin. Allow me to show you. So, as you can see, this is just one of my terminal tackle trays. Uh, I've got hooks in here. And the easiest way that I found is to use a two inch hook, or sorry, a two inch paper clip and store hooks on them. Obviously, I don't put too many on them or otherwise it just turns into a mess again when you're trying to open this up and take a hook off. But boom, there you go. And they're also good for swivels, snap swivels, if you tend to use those. I do, um, because I often don't bring too many rods with me unless I'm tournament angling, then I bring a whole pile and I don't really change too often. But if I only am out fun fishing, I might only bring one or two rods with me. So I do tend to use snap swivels. Anyway, same principle, they're all right here. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now, the inch and a half one, a little smaller, I tend to use those either for the snap swivels, in this case I'm actually using a bigger one, but here, some other snap swivels, I've got an on the inch and a half, or I tend to use smaller hooks, such as this. Now, one recommendation I would make is when you put the hook on the uh, safety pin that you angle the hook ends away from the end that you're opening. That way you don't have a whole bunch of hooks going this way and you're trying to open it and you're getting jammed at the bottom of your thumb by hooks. Uh, I don't usually, I haven't followed that principle completely on my own as you can see. I do have some hooks that are angling the forward way, not a good idea, but that's what I use. And if you use a regular size Plano tray, these will fit inside. I tend to use the thinner uh, Plano trays, about an inch deep, because I want to pack as many Plano trays in a tackle bag as possible. So it can be a little bit of a tight fit in there, but once you close the Plano tray, it's all good. Anyway, like I said, I figured that might be something that uh, when you're in the deep colds of winter, if where you are it's cold, that, you know, you're going through your tackle box, doing your maintenance, and you're like, hey, I wish there was an easier way to store hooks. Well, here you go. Safety pins. I don't know. Like I said, quick and dirty video. If you found this vaguely interesting or informative, you know, feel free to give it a like, a share, leave a comment. If you didn't like it, well, give it a thumbs down. I mean, that's cool too. I don't learn what you like or what you don't like unless you leave, leave some kind of feedback. Uh, you can buy these pretty cheap. I mean, go to a dollar store. You can probably get like a hundred of these for a dollar, two, three dollars, whatever. And that's it. Bob's your uncle. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you have a great day. If you're still able to fish where you are, tight lines. If not, eh, sorry you like me. It's snow. Take care. Bye.